Hi, Christina Hi. here. Hi, Vera here. And we're from Souls Enlightenment, as if you guys didn't already know that. <laughs> exactly. So this is a really cool story that Vera was picked up on some uh, past life information on. Mm -hmm. And it was a story that was uh, trending on, on the Facebook. Uh, yeah, online. Yeah. And Vera, you want to tell them a little bit about yeah, it? Yeah, it was it, it caught my eye too because it was about a little girl named Brooklyn, and she had seen this garbage man go by her house every Thursday. I don't know if it was her house or a daycare, but it went by her every Thursday, this, mm -hmm. this garbage truck. And she just was enchanted with the driver. Oh. And it, it was a soul connection, oh. you know? And come to find out his name is Delvar. And she would wave at him in the window, you know, every Thursday. Mm -hmm. And then finally she... And he'd wave too. And he'd wave oh. back. And then she finally <laughs> talked her mother or whoever was in charge of her that she can stand in the driveway so that she can oh. see him go by. So she would do that and he, she would wave. And then if she missed him on that Thursday, she would make her mother <laughs> drive her around the neighborhood until they found Delvar. That's so cute. And then she would wave at him. <laughs> yeah, it was so cute. And then finally for her birthday, to make a long story short, because I already have it on Facebook, mm -hmm. but it was her birthday and she wanted to share her cupcake, her birthday cupcake with Delvar. Mm -hmm. So, you know, she, she, their mother flagged him down and they took pictures and it was just the cutest thing. It was Aww. awesome. And that smile that Delvar has for that little girl. He has got the biggest smile. I mean, what a beautiful shine. smile. He is just like such a bright light. Yeah. The way you can just see it. Yeah. And just smile. Yeah, yeah. exactly. But what I picked up about with Brooklyn was she remembers him from a past life. It was in the 1920s. And, you know, at first I thought they were just best friends, but I keep getting that they were siblings. But attached at the hip kind of, you know, the best yeah. friend. Yeah, siblings like best friends. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, and Delvar was female in that life. She was female in that so life. So she was Brooklyn's sister in that life. Yes. Got it. Yeah, Delvar was, yeah. And... Her name was Hannah in that, in that past life. So Brooklyn's name was Hannah? Yes. Aww. Yeah. And I can't get Delvar's name. I can't pick it up right now. But, um, yeah, but they were swimming, and um, Brooklyn, Hannah, was drowning. Mm -hmm. And so Delvar went to save her and did. She was saved, but then Delvar drowned. Oh, you know, so it was something, it was like, that's sad. Yeah, it no. was sad, but it still has that, that connection where she still, rem you know, she has this wow. connection to that man, you know. Did she have survivor's guilt yeah. in her life? Yeah. You know. But she was so young. I mean, not that young. I think they were like six or something. But Oh, that's young. Yeah. So I don't really know if, you know, she really remembers. I see. But she remembers. You yeah. know, and it's what's neat too. I was thinking about um, is that I was reading the story after you told me, and I went to go look at it. And mm -hmm. the day that she gave him the cupcake, the mom was driving her to the daycare, mm -hmm. and Brooklyn was so quiet. And she said, "Are you know, are you okay?" and kind of thing. And Brooklyn said, "I'm just so happy." Yeah, isn't that? Cute? She just said, "I'm just so happy." And I was thinking, gosh, you know, like you said. That's that part of her that remembers, mm -hmm. and it's got to be kind of like a, just an amazing and also kind of healing thing. I mean, here was this soul that saved her, mm -hmm. and she sees him, there he is, and he's and okay. And she has to connect with him. Yeah, yeah, and she has to connect, and and it's really neat too because it's like you know we chart to see mm -hmm. these souls again, and that it was, was healing love. for her too because she saw that he's alive, yeah. that he lived on, you know. He's, so that helped yeah. with her guilt. Yeah, to, mm -hmm. to heal that part of yeah. her. That he's alive, he's okay, mm -hmm. he's, ha he's smiling. He's smiling, yeah. you know. And you could tell that he cares for her. You know? Very much. Yeah, I mean, because he didn't have to do what he did. No. You know, but, and she didn't have to do what she did. But children are amazing. You know, and as long as they're not beat down and told, oh, that's not true, or you're being silly. Yeah. You know, it really helps them to uh, hone that skill that they have, and they can keep it for the rest of their lives. For sure. Yeah. It's really neat, too, because, you know, we can 
chart. We do chart these mm -hmm. souls that cross paths again for these different, you know, healing ways. I mean, they might not be super involved in each other's life in the but future. But that was all she needed to see. Exactly. And, you know, you can feel it when you see somebody and you can just connect. It's like yeah. a kindred spirit that yeah. you can feel in your heart. Exactly. You know, within you. Yeah. So that's really a special yeah. story. That was so cool. I just, I love it. You know, and it's neat, too, because there's so many reasons why we can chart to run into them again for, mm -hmm. for healing, for also um, uh, to balance out an experience maybe. And also you never know what's going on in somebody's life. Mm -hmm. Sometimes that the way that somebody treats us as like that we're somebody special can really be something that we can draw upon when we yeah, need it most. Exactly. You know? And I applaud um, Brooklyn's mom. Because, yeah. you know, she just went with it. She didn't say, oh, get away from that window, or no, you're not going outside. Isn't that the truth? You know, or I'm not going to drive you around the neighborhood, you know, yeah. that kind of thing. So. She sounded so nice. Yeah. 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 A cool mom. She's really, yeah. you know, she's really a, a bright light herself. Yeah. yeah. That's really neat. So, anyway, thank you for, for joining us today and hearing about Brooklyn and Del Bar's yeah. story. And thank you, Vera. Oh, you're welcome. That was really neat. Well, I, we will see you next Saturday. Yeah. Many blessings. Bye. Bye.